Hey guys, this is Colby with Moto Safari here today talking to you about my motorcycles and some of the gear that I wear. As you know, I've got a 2019 Yamaha R3, a 2019 BMW S1000 Single R, and a 2019 Ducati Panigale V4S. So just wanted to walk you through some of the stuff that I've done, as well as an update on some of the gear that I'm wearing. Just an update on life in general. It's been super hot in North Carolina, so I thought this would be a good way to just keep in touch with you guys to make sure you know. Yeah, I'm still alive, I'm still riding, it's just really hard to boil alive on Ducati in this weather. So, let's hop right into it. And the first motorcycle, obviously, is gonna be my 2019 Ducati V4S Panigale. Um, I have recently done this rear delete to it, which looks really awesome, as well as the best upgrade to do to one of these V4S. They clear clutch cover by Duke of Bike. Um, otherwise, this is the V4S model, so you've got the electronic suspension, um, the gold front forks, it looks awesome. I'll do a quick crank up for you guys and try not to die. Carbon monoxide, and you can see how this thing works. Otherwise, man, that is a beast of a bike. That is definitely not a commuter, though. Um, I will say that. It is not happy when you are stopping and going. Commuter bike would be this baby right here, the BMW S1000 Single R. Um, a brother to my previous 2018 BMW S1000 XR. This is the HP model, the white, red, and blue color scheme and it also has the Acra exhaust already on it which is fantastic it's the exhaust that I would put on it um, this one has not had a rear delete put on it yet I don't know if I will the only upgrades to this bad boy is maybe a front radiator guard just because it's so revealed up there it does look bad to the bone though which is fantastic so I'm gonna do a little test on this one it's a little bit more quiet than the Ducati obviously um, Finally, the Yamaha R3 2019 model in matte black, which all of you guys know if you have been on this channel before. So this one has had all of the upgrades you can probably do to it in a lot of ways besides small things like grips and handlebars. It's been lowered. LEDs on the front and the back. you got the lowering link so my wife can ride a little bit easier. My wife rides both of these, but... Um, you know, she enjoys this one more because it's a little bit more comfortable. This one is definitely a little bit taller for her, um, her being 5'2 and all. So going over here, my helmet, um, for me personally, I've got a Arai Corsair X or Corsair 10 helmet. That's my wife's AGV. I've got a Shoei Neotech 2, which is my more touring helmet. It has a Pack Talk Bold Cardo unit in it. And then an HJC CL17, which is my GoPro helmet, because I have it all stickied up and Velcroed. I don't wear that everywhere. As far as shoes, I've got these Dynasty um, High Rise Gore Tech shoes. They've been awesome. They are expensive, but shoes are definitely worth it. Ankle protection. Um, as far as mesh jacket, I've got this Dynasty mesh jacket. Not sure the model. Revit mesh as well and then i've got some dynasty pants i believe they're like the mill is what the model is for those so other than that guys i appreciate you watching thanks for going through my bike collection 2019's r3 s1000 single r and v4s i will see you guys on the flip side if you haven't already subscribe to the channel put the notifications on and click that bell and i'll get some more content out for you guys soon thanks